welcome to tutorial number three in this tutorial we're going to draw slabs and make modifications to our walls so take the slab tool go to settings set the thickness to 30 then uh, texture choose uh, paint white paint I guess this one or let's say glossy white <laughs> and choose the geometry method into polygonal and start drawing it Yes, from here, like this. that <coughs> go to second floor and here choose floor 2 and start drawing it Floor number three, choose floor three here. Uh, let's start from here. and make sure that you go here move this Then the roof, choose here roof. There is another one, uh, where is it? This is zero. Okay, let's just draw it and after we are going to change 
this will be paint gray where is the gray yeah dark gray just going to draw it like this There you are. Let's have a look at 3D. Okay, there we are. There is a little gap here. Let's select and set this to zero. Okay, so in this case, choose this here. There you are. And the same for the rest. This, this, this. This is zero. This is this one. There you are. Alright, so now we have drawn our slabs. Okay, so then uh, let's modify our uh, wall here and rotate. I would like to change the settings of this wall here, just this one to be the striped one but when I select it all of the walls are selected so I need to activate the suspend group tool so that I can only focus on this so this is the suspend group activate and select this and from the um, favorite palette double click striped wall here there you are ground floor let's see if it's at its place ground okay be careful our wall has moved okay so to put back it to its place select it and click this toggle F3. For those, when I select it, I need to deactivate this first, okay, so that I can select all of the walls and I apply this, okay, and the same for this striped wall. Now rotate, you see, now it's well done. Alright, so uh, reactivate suspend group, select this part, and um, apply striped wall. Okay. For this I deactivate this so that I can select all of those. I will add more. Um, I mean, this will be 90 centimeters more here. So I set 90 here. Hit OK. There you are. And the same for this. No only that part I activate suspend group activate 90 there you are and uh, for this part here these are striped wall like this but little difference is that the distance between the stripes are bigger than this one 
so I just apply stripe wall okay now I'm going to uh, change the settings and besides I'm going to show you how I get the striped wall parameters so you go to settings and log details here and you choose this okay you activate his to use a log wall and then <coughs> I'm going we're going to use this one here and set the distance between 240 like that and uh, I do the same to this one okay use click here 40 there you are okay there you are <coughs> and now we need to change some colors of the wall like this and this will be white wall I go to settings and directly choose paint glossy white or you can also use stucco white rough this okay and the same for this uh, let me rotate this by pressing shift and pressing uh, your mouse roller you can rotate select select change them to glossy white paint glossy white there you are okay and the same here inside here will be white as well this this change to paint glossy white okay here will be white this one too will be white okay and um, this part of the wall is here will be a balcony so there is no wall here so I go to floor number three here then I'm going to uh, cut those parts by pressing the control key activate your wall press control key hold and click like this F3 to see there you are there you are okay so um, here we are and that's it for this part see you to the next part Thank <laughs> you.